do you know that there Did you know that there are so many drawbacks when it comes to trending with a small account? Yes, that is true. If you are trending with a small account, you're just going to experience more drawbacks than the advantages that you're just going to be getting over there. This is the topic that you're just going to be talking over here. And since so many people don't want to hear about this, make sure that you pressure yourself actually to just listen to this video until the end of it. Now, let's just start over here and let's start defining what is a small account. For You know, for the people actually trend a huge amount of money you can just say is that small account is account with less than ten thousand dollars not ten thousand kenya shillings but ten thousand that means over one million kenya shillings over there but because we are just as last over there let's just talk about the reality over here uh, so that we can just learn all these things okay here i'm talking personally i'm just talking about the account that's as less than five hundred dollars so if you are trading with a small with less than one hundred dollars these are the things that you're just going to be getting here on the market. They are very important to not make sure that if you're just doing this, you can actually even raise more amount of money. But just note this. Uh, don't be confused that the higher you just be having the higher account, they're sure you're going to be making money. Of course, there's more things more than uh, your account balance that is just in to trend that are in it. skills and all those things will just be needed right over here. So number one of the things that is just going to one of the drawbacks I always get with small account is the limited trading opportunity. This means that uh, with a small uh, account, you may have limited trading opportunities where you may only be able to trade a few currencies pairs you know or may be able to train during a certain market condition you can just limit your potential profit and make it more difficult to achieve your trending goals so that's just very easy and self explanatory over there you know when you just have small amount of money then you just limit all, all of you you cannot go to these currencies market condition means that when there is a news you cannot trade because the market is very volatile and sometimes you can just enter the market and then you just blow your account so you have to know that when you have small account it's just going to limit you to trade so many pairs like very volatile uh, pairs you can just avoid that that gone is you cannot train gold if you have ten dollars because the owner is just going to in case the market just goes and against you you can just lose the money very fast okay the other thing is the higher risk that is number two when trading with a small account you may need use high what we call the leverage and to make your trains okay this means that even small price movement can have a significant impact on your account balance and then you may risk losing all your capital if the market actually just goes against you okay so that is the first thing that you have to know number two of the list is lack of flexibility flexibility over here means that um, you may not have enough margin okay to hold on to position for a long time okay let's say you have opened the trend and the trend has just uh, gone against you with a certain amount of money but you know at least it has gone against me but when it reaches a certain level it's just going to reverse back so if you don't have good amount of capital then you are just going to assist from the market very highly even if you know yes it will just continue to go against me for this time but it's just going to reverse back so the small account is actually going to limit you from that opportunity and uh that is one of the things that you just have to know and the last thing you'll just be talking over here which is very important it's actually the psychological pressure when you talk about the psychological pressure over here trending opportunity can actually put an additional psychological pressure you know on you as a trainer the reason i'm not again talking about the psychological pressure is because sometimes you just be, be trending over there you have small account you know you always be checking on the market because you have your uh 20 dollars over there you just fear the market you know forex is a very volatile market and with uh, small things over here you can just end up blowing your account so that's the first thing that you just have to be knowing over there so you may end up checking your market checking your market and actually you can even close at the wrong 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 time sometimes you can even see the market is making profit small profit and then you can just take zero point two dollars you see one dollar is formed you just cut off you know you you see negative one dollar and two dollars your account uh it just cost for the 
margin and all that so it will just develop what we call a psychological pressure at least if you just have a very big account then you just have to know you're just going to be using what we call um you can use if you have the biggest account you can use uh like the smallest low size you know you use the low margin so that even if the market just goes against you at the wrong line the market will just reverse and you just be in profit so you just be missing the time you just be losing your money over here to just finish this is that you have to know using a small account in forex trading can limit you in trading opportunity increase your risk and limit your flexibility as a trader and also psychological pressure so that is the overview all you just have to do is to increase your risk and limit your uh yes so while we may be tempting you to start with a small account it is important actually to just weigh the potential of drawbacks before making a decision if you are just starting out in forex training it may be worth considering a demo account or starting with a larger account balance to give yourself a flexibility and a reduce risk then for you watching and don't forget to subscribe for this channel tips for more tips and more strategies okay so i will see you next time bye bye let me just uh do some trendings over here i can see the market is just doing good bye